What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today we have another sauce review. Another one that I've been sitting on for a while, not literally, but figuratively. And um, this is distributed by the Beef Jerky Outlet franchise out of Kodak, Tennessee. Find them at beefjerkyx.com. And this is the Beef Jerky Experience's Mild Peach Habanero Delight Hot Sauce. Now, I paid $9.99 for this at the Beef Jerky Outlet. Their stuff is a little pricey, but it's good. You know, I love their mustards. They have a snack mix that has cheddar pretzels and brown sugar bourbon pretzels in it, and it's really good. don't know if they even still have it anymore, but it's pretty good, too. Anyway, you can download our app or shop or review products at beefjerkyx.com. And it says, use on fish and shrimp tacos, poultry and fish, or even as a... Use on fish and shrimp tacos, poultry and fish, or even as a salad dressing. I love the label there. Got some habaneros and peaches on there. Pretty cool. Uh, five servings per container. Serving is one ounce. That is a big serving. 25 calories. So the whole bottle. Only 250. There's only 125 calories. So anyway, your ingredients are as follows. Sliced peaches, which are peaches, peach juice, pear juice, natural flavor, and ascorbic acid. You have white vinegar, pineapple, which is pineapple, water, sugar, and citric acid. Red peppers, purple onion, olive oil, sugar, garlic, habanero pepper, salt, and xanthan gum. Now habanero pepper is way at the bottom of that list. So I'm not going to expect it to be hot. But on the other hand, just like any other pepper, you know, every habanero is at the same heat, just like jalapenos. I've had some jalapenos that have been hotter than some habaneros I've had. It just depends. I guess it just depends how much capsaicin they produce. Anyway, after getting done talking like I know what I'm talking about, I'll get this open hopefully and try it. Maybe. Probably so old the seal won't even come off, it's so fragile. Good lord, come on. Come on, there we go. Pardon me with my sinuses, they blow. Give us a good shaky shaker. Got some stuff stuck up in the neck there. Trying to get it in and out of the neck. Good shaky shake. All right. Well, we're gonna have another sauce uh, giving us issues that. Let's push everything down in. Now, we'll give it a good shaky shake. And it's still being a doofus. So, you know what? We're just going to have to do this again. Maybe. Yeah, get that air pocket in there so that stuff slides down. There we go. Okay. We're just have to run with it here, people. Uh, the consistency check, as you can see, is pretty thick. <laughs> but we also got that plugage, so... If we can get that plugage to come out, we'll be able to get some sauce here. Maybe. Oh, there we go. There we go. Get that big glava peach or whatever. Whoa. Okay. There we go. Look at that. It's about to drip off the bottle. No. No. I mean, drip off the spoon. No. No, oh, it ain't on me. We're good. Anyway, there's what it looks like. And we're going to have to go because it is. I really poured too much out. So, from the beef jerky. Experience their peach habanero delight hot sauce. Cheers. My bottle. Try to give it a good shaky shake now with that big glob of plugage out of there. Definitely real peaches, that's for sure. 
see some of the fibers of the peaches in here. It's good. I mean, you get the peach. I get the garlic. I get the purple onion, too. The habanero is barely there, which would make sense considering how far down the ingredient list it really is. Oh, I dripped on my shirt. Or my coat. Well, we won't waste it. Yeah, it's garlicky and peachy. <laughs> Well, I'm going to be honest. You can see the habanero skins in there. But I've had cayenne sauce that's been harder than this, and that's legit. But cheers, we're going to chug it. Yeah, it says mild, mild would. This is below mild. Like I say, get the peaches. <sighs> Maybe a little bit of the pineapple. Yeah, you have to get some of the pineapple too. A little purple onion, the habanero, a touch, and the garlic. But. Well, that's good. I'm be careful piece of glass ch chip off of there. That's nice. Didn't even notice that. They're going to cut my lip. Uh, but honestly, for $9.99, it is not worth it at all. This is probably a $5 sauce tops. I mean, it's a good peach garlic flavor, but I'm not getting very little heat. My lips are a little touch of tingle, but for habanero, this is weak. But, then again, it's second from the last, third from the last on ingredients. 20 ingredients, so. But, uh, it's not bad. I would definitely use this maybe as a dessert sauce with the peaches. Uh, maybe as a marinade for fish or shrimp, but, uh, yeah, I'm not, uh, not digging it. So, excuse me. Beef jerky experience is mild peach habanero delight. Now, mild is one thing, but this literally is below mild. <clears throat> they should have a category called not mild, and this is where this sauce would go for $9.99. It's not worth it at all. Say $4.99 tops. Um, now, the heat, honestly, zero. Maybe a half. It's just a little tingle. I'm trying to cut my lip. Feels weird. Anyway, uh, flavor, <clears throat> I'm going to give it a 4 out of 10 because i really not getting much habanero. Um, like I say, I would use this maybe maybe on cheesecake, maybe as a seafood marinade, but I would definitely not buy this again. I would suggest you don't buy it either. Not for $9.99 a bottle. Ain't worth it. That's probably even more now. But uh, but yeah, this is the my review on the beef jerky experiences, mild peach habanero delight. If you're just starting the hot sauce, this would probably be good for you, but this is not gonna give you any kind of sense of what you're gonna expect if you go hotter. <clears throat> I mean, cause this is below mild, but I'll use it. Like I say, I drank half of it, so. Uh, but not, not good. <laughs> Anyway, with that said, I hope you enjoyed this review. See you next time.